Welcome to Fundamentals of Sound. My name is Tom Beaton. A little bit about my background. I graduated with a Bachelor of Science degree in sound recording technology in 1983, when only two schools in the United States offered accredited degrees in audio engineering. A few months after graduating, I was on a flight to Orlando, which I have called home ever since. Working for a theme park I didn't even know existed a year earlier. I started my audio career as a live show stage technician for Walt Disney World, then after a few years transferred from live shows to the department providing support for events involving corporate executives, first as a senior show technician and finally moving up to senior show producer before leaving the company after just about 15 years. While working for Disney in the mid-1980s, I was an adjunct professor at Valencia Community College teaching sound for the stage for a new technical theater program they were considering. This course replaces the course I initially taught, and I'm excited to see the new music technology program that has grown from those early beginnings. I've been back on staff as an adjunct professor since 2018 teaching this course again. While at Disney, I also designed computer hardware to control fireworks for the nighttime water show at Epcot. After leaving Disney, I started Blue Moon Interactive with two other friends to produce websites and interactive video projects for various clients, including Disney. And after I left Blue Moon Interactive, I spent 15 years at iHeartMedia, where I designed and maintained a few music data analytic products including RateTheMusic.com, a system capable of analyzing many thousands of music survey results in real time, and Music Tracker, which combined data from multiple sources like YouTube, Spotify, Pandora, Shazam, all with the end goal of helping iHeartMedia schedule music on their radio stations nationwide. From 2015 to 2021, I was the director of interactive technology for a local company that operates eight radio stations in the central Florida area. My primary duties included managing all mobile apps, website servers, audio streaming servers, and internal control and operational web applications. I also worked closely with the engineering and on-air departments to assist with audio related operations. In June 2021, I changed jobs, and I am now a senior software developer and system administrator for Harlow Health, helping employer groups and employees reduce healthcare costs. This is my first job since college that is not directly or indirectly involved in the audio engineering industry. Along with my bachelor's degree in sound recording, I also have a master's degree in business administration from UCF, a master's of divinity degree, and a cyber risk management certificate. For fun, I enjoy hanging out with my dog Jasper, traveling and visiting new places, riding my bike, reading, building random electronic stuff, and setting up my annual animated Christmas light display in my front yard. Each week will consist of at least one module. Depending on the length of the semester, there may be more than one module within one week. Each module will consist of three parts. The lecture. This section will usually consist of a video that can be watched at your convenience during the week. It's pre-recorded, so you may watch it at your own pace and repeat it if necessary. The discussion. Since this course is being presented in a mixed mode fashion, being mostly online, this section will allow you to converse with your fellow students. Each week, unless otherwise noticed in the discussion instructions, you will need to make one original post and respond to at least two other students' posts. Please listen carefully. You must write at least three sentences with substantial content. Simply saying something like, I liked this week's video, or I learned something about, insert topic here, I never knew, is not sufficient. Remember, this is the in-class discussion since we are not meeting in person. 
You must make your initial post during the lesson week and your two responses are due one week later. See the syllabus for the due dates. Each week, you will also have a short quiz to ensure that you understand each topic's basic concepts. In most cases, you can repeat the quiz if you'd like to receive a higher grade. The highest grade will be used for your final grade. There will be three exams throughout the semester. The first two exams will test the material learned in the previous four modules, and the final exam will be somewhat comprehensive for the whole semester, but will mostly focus on the last four modules of the semester. The weekly quizzes and three exams will all be taken online through Canvas, and you will have the entire week to take them, but each has a time limit once it is started. You can use the lecture notes, the PowerPoint presentations, and even Google searches along with your textbooks to find the answers. To me, it's more important to know the answers and where to find them instead of memorizing information for a few weeks only to forget it within a week. Also throughout the semester, we will have three in-person class meetings. These class times and dates are listed in the syllabus and you must show up for all three in order to get credit. I understand what it's like to be a student, the challenges of managing life, a job, and homework, and I genuinely want you to succeed. Do not hesitate to contact me through Canvas, by phone, or by text. Watch all the videos I post, read the course materials, complete the assignments, and you will easily be able to pass this course.